Now question number 4. A. What should be added to x squared plus xy plus y squared to obtain 2x squared plus 3xy? So now in order to get the number we should subtract x squared plus xy plus y squared from 2x squared plus 3xy. So we do subtraction for that. So 2x squared plus 3xy minus x squared plus xy plus y squared. So now I have to clear the bracket. 2x squared plus 3xy minus x squared minus xy minus y squared. So now after uh, opening the bracket, now we have to collect the like terms. 2x squared minus x squared plus 3xy minus xy minus y squared. So now 2x squared minus x squared will become x squared plus 3xy minus xy will become 2xy then minus y squared. So therefore x squared plus 2xy minus y squared should be added 2x squared plus xy plus y squared to get 2x squared plus 3xy. Now question B, what should be subtracted from 2a plus 8b plus 10 to get minus 3a plus 7b plus 16. So now here in order to get the number we should subtract minus 3a plus 7b plus 16 from 2a plus 8b plus 10. So that 2a plus 8b plus 10 minus and the first term is minus 3a, 3a plus 7b plus 16. So in that we will, now we will open the bracket that will become 2a plus 8b plus 10 minus and minus will become plus. So plus 3a minus and plus will become minus. So minus 7b and minus 16. Now collect the like terms. 2a plus 3a plus 8b minus 7b plus 10 minus 16. 2 plus 3, 5a. Then 8 minus 7 will become 1. So plus 1b minus 10 plus 10 minus 16. So 16 minus 10 will become 6. That will be given. We will keep before minus. So 5 therefore 5a plus b minus 6 should be subtracted from 2a plus 8b plus 10 to get minus 3a plus 7b plus 16. Now question number 5. What should be taken away from 3x squared minus 4y squared plus 5xy plus 20 to obtain minus x squared minus y squared plus 6xy plus 20. Obtain means to get. So in order to get the required number, we must subtract minus x squared minus y squared plus 6xy plus 20 from 3x squared minus 4x squared for minus 4y squared plus 5xy plus 20. So now 3x squared minus 4y squared plus 5xy plus 20 minus inside the bracket minus x squared minus y squared plus 6y plus 20. Now clear the bracket 3x squared plus minus 4y squared plus 5xy plus 20 minus into minus plus y squared plus x squared plus y squared. Then minus into plus is minus 6xy plus into minus minus 20. Now collect the like terms 3x squared plus x squared then minus 4y squared plus y squared plus 5xy minus 6xy then plus 20 minus 20. Now 3 plus 1 4x squared minus 4 plus 1y squared so minus 3y squared then plus 5xy minus 6xy so that will become minus xy then plus 20 and minus 20 will become 0. Thus 4x squared minus 3y squared minus xy should be taken away from 3x squared minus 4y squared plus 5xy plus 20 to obtain minus x squared minus y squared plus 6y plus 20. Now question number 6a from the sum of 3x minus y plus 11 and minus y minus 11 subtract 3x minus y minus 11. So what you have to do first you have to sub add the 2 that is 3x minus y plus 11 and minus y minus 11 you have to add whatever the answer you are getting from that you have to subtract 3y minus 3x minus y minus 11 so we will do addition the sum of these two 
So 3x minus y plus 11 plus inside the bracket minus y minus 11. Now open the bracket plus into minus will become minus minus y plus into minus minus 11. So now collect the like terms 3x minus 3x then minus y minus y plus 11 minus 11. So 3x minus y minus y will become minus 2y plus 11 minus 11 will become 0. So we got 3x minus 2y. Now subtracting 3x minus y minus 11 from 3x minus 2y. So 3x minus 2y minus of 3x minus y minus 11. So minus into 3x is minus 3x. Minus and minus will become plus. So plus y. Minus into minus plus 11. Now collect the like terms. 3x minus 3x minus 2y plus 2y then plus 11. So 3x minus 3x will become 0. Minus 2y plus y will become minus y plus 11. So the answer is minus y plus 11. Now question number B. From the sum of 4 plus 3x and 5 minus 4x plus 2x squared. Subtract the sum of 3x squared minus 5x and minus x squared plus 2x plus 5. So first you, ask, first you have to find the sum. We have to add these two. 4 plus 3x and 5 minus 4x plus 2x squared. So that is one addition. Then what you have to do? One more. The sum of 3x squared minus 5x and minus x squared plus 2x plus 5. So first we will do addition for this. You will get the answer. In the second one you have to do the addition of these two. You will get the answer. And you have to subtract it from whatever the first one you are getting the addition. From that you have to subtract the second one. So first one the sum of 4 plus 3x and 5 minus 4x plus 2x squared. So we have added it. So 4 plus 3x plus 5 minus 4x plus 2x squared. Collect the like terms. 4 plus 5 plus 3x minus 4x plus 2x squared. Now 4 plus 5 is 9 plus 3x minus 4x will become minus x and plus 2x squared. Now the second sum, the sum of 2, 3x squared minus 5x and minus x squared minus 2x plus 5. So addition 3x squared minus 5x plus inside the bracket minus x squared minus 2x plus 5. Now clear the bracket so 3x squared minus 5x plus into minus minus x squared plus into minus minus 2x plus into plus plus into plus it will become plus 5. So this will become 3x squared minus collect the like terms 3x squared minus x squared then minus 5x minus 2x then plus 5. Now 2x squared 3x minus 1 will become 2x squared minus 5x minus 2x will become minus 7x and plus 5. Now subtracting 2x squared minus 3x plus 5 from 9 minus x plus 2x squared. How we got these two that we have added that. So we get 9 minus x plus 2x squared minus 2x squared minus 3x plus 5. So clearing the bracket. Minus into 2x squared. So minus 2x squared minus and minus will become plus plus 3x. And minus into plus it will become minus 5. So now collect the like terms. Now 9 and minus 5. Then minus x. Then plus 3x. Then plus 2x squared minus 2x squared. So 9 minus 5 will become 4. Minus x plus 3x. It will become plus 2x. Plus 2x squared minus 2x squared will become 0. So the answer is 4 plus 2x.